We have not reached even halfway through 2024, and already the universe has treated us to two spectacular and stunning sky events, the Great American Total Solar Eclipse in April and the Aurora Show that took place in the second week of May. And now get ready to witness another incredible sky event. A dazzling comet is racing towards us and will be visible in Earth's sky with the naked eye from September to October this year, hopefully ending the long, dry spell of getting a chance to see a beautiful comet with a long, wispy tail stretching across our star-studded sky. It seems the list of once-in-a-lifetime sky-gazing events is endless in 2024, and we can't be happier. This comet, C2023A3, Suchinshan Atlas, is now gaining popularity as the comet of the year. Want to know all about this comet? and from where and when it will be visible? Continue watching to find out. Welcome to Lab 360, it's time to explore. Earthlings eagerly wait for these visitors from the cold, icy boundaries of our solar system. The particular area from where most long-period comets generally come to visit Earth is the Oort Cloud. The Oort Cloud is a sphere surrounding our solar system that comprises billions of comets. It lies beyond the heliosphere in interstellar space. This particular cosmic snowball has an orbital period of 80,000 years, with orbital period denoting the time the comet takes to orbit around the sun once. Did you know that a comet's tail can stretch up to one astronomical unit, which is the distance between the Earth and the sun? Comet A3 was discovered in January 2023 by astronomers at both South Africa's Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System, the Atlas Telescope, and China's Tsuchinshan Observatory also known as Purple Mountain Observatory. So where is the comet right now? Currently sailing between Mars and Jupiter and visible only through large telescopes, Comet A3 is headed for a rendezvous with our Earth later this year, when it will become increasingly brighter. Large telescopes can currently locate it in the constellation of Virgo in our night skies. What makes Tsuchinshan special is that it is expected to sport a beautiful long cometary tail. Those who got the chance to view Comet McNaught in January 2007 know what a spectacular show these fuzzy friends from far with tails can put up in the night sky. So when is Comet A3 going to treat us to its fantastic show? When and from where can the comet be seen? It will be better visible from the southern hemisphere in the east before sunrise in late September. From September 27th to October 2nd, it appears in the twilight-soaked morning sky of the Northern Hemisphere, but it will be very low in the sky. The comet's perihelion, its closest approach to the Sun, is slated to occur on the 27th of September 2024, and hence, it will disappear from sight during that period. If it manages to survive this encounter with our Sun, then the closest approach of this icy visitor to Earth will occur on the 13th of October 2024, it will again slingshot in the night skies in the northern hemisphere when October opens. And from October 11th, it will appear in the west after sunset, possibly shining as bright as Venus. Post that, it will go higher in the sky each evening, making it easier to observe. The scientific name of Comet Tsuchinshan Atlas is C2023A3. In this name, C stands for a non-periodic comet, that is, comets which take at least 200 years to complete one orbit around the sun. 2023 denotes the year in which this comet was discovered. A denotes that this comet was discovered in the first half of January. 3 denotes it was the third comet to be discovered in that period. It is notoriously difficult to predict the behavior of comets, as they're composed of loosely bound volatile materials like ice, and as they get closer to the sun, the ice evaporates or sublimates. Still, astronomers expect it to get as bright as the planet Venus in our night skies. And as many astronomy enthusiasts among you might already be knowing, Venus is the brightest object in our skies after the sun and the moon. So if Tsuchinshan does behave as predicted, it could well get the sobriquet of the Comet of the Year. Or maybe even Comet of the Century. Who knows? The last comets worthy of the title of Great Comets were hale in 1997 and McNaught in 2007. So let's just wait and see what this celestial visitor from the farthest boundaries of our solar system has in store for us. But that's not all. We've made a video where we talk about all the other eye-popping astronomical events that are set to grace our skies in 2024. So if you're interested, you can check out the video. Share your thoughts in the comments section below. 
and be sure to subscribe to the channel for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated, and let's continue to explore together.